Ralph Howard Kosham, February 25, 1936 to September 30, 2014, was a British-born American film, stage, and voice actor and book narrator. He was a member of the acting companies of the Washington Theatre Club, the Folger Shakespeare Library, Arena Stage, and the Shakespeare Theatre all in Washington, D.C. Several of his works were awarded Audio Best of the Year by Publishers Weekly. In early 1964, Hamilton Company Ltd. contracted with United Press International to prepare a special souvenir magazine of the Beatles' first visit to America. His interviews with concertgoers and reports were published as The Beatles at Carnegie Hall, which remains easy to find today. In voice acting he was featured in the video game The Elder Scrolls IV, Oblivion as the Breton Males, including characters such as Joffre, the Grand Master of the Blades, and Vicente Valtieri, Dr. Gervish in Death Without Consent, 2005, he played the voice part Townspeople 3 in Pirates of the Caribbean, 2003. In acting he was a driver in Shadow Conspiracy, 1997, Supreme Court Justice Jensen in The Pelican Brief, 1993, Judge Isel Stewart in Suspect, 1987, a Marine Lieutenant in Starman, 1984, and played the part of Braddock S. Captain in the mini-TV series George Washington, 1984. Wells, The Castle by Franz Kafka, The Secret Agent, 1996, Heart of Darkness, 2002, Frankenstein, 2002, Around the World in 80 Days, 2003, Alice in Wonderland, 2004, Watership Down, 2010, Dead Man's Chest, 2001 novel by Roger Johnson, narrated in 2006, King Leopold's Ghost, Postwar, A History of Europe Since 1945, numerous works of C.S. Lewis including The Space Trilogy, Miracles, Mere Christianity, The Problem of Pain and the Screwtape Letters, as well as a collection of American short stories titled The American Experience, a collection of great American stories, 2004. Kosham was the only narrator for a series of mysteries written by Louise Penny, he won audiophile earphones and library journal awards for best audiobook and the Mystery Audio Award in 2013 for The Beautiful Mystery. Ralph Kosham died of an illness on Tuesday, September 30, 2014 at his home in Reston, Virginia, at the age of 78.